So let's try and graph the equation y equals minus 4 fifths x plus 2. To graph this line, we'll need to find two points on the line. We can find the coordinates x, y by choosing a value for either x or y and solving for the other variable. Since this equation is already solved for y, we can choose a value of x and compute a value of y. So if x equals 0, then since y equals minus 4 fifths x plus 2, we find that y is equal to 2, so the point 0, 2 is on the line. And so the line passes through the points 0, 2. Now we need to find a second point. While we could choose any value we want for x, we might consider that because we're going to be multiplying x by this fraction, if we multiply a fraction by its denominator, that will eliminate the fraction. And so while we can choose any value we want for x, if we let x equal to 5, we'll eliminate the fraction. So if x equals 5, we find that y equals minus 4 fifths x plus 2, and so y will be negative 2. And so the point 5, negative 2 is also on the line, and so our line passes through the points 0, 2, and 5, negative 2. And so now we can try and graph that line. So first, we'll go to our point 0, 2. And my open math wants to draw a line at this point, so we've got to be careful and go exactly to the point 5, negative 2. Now if you click on the wrong point, you can use clear all, but you'll have to start the graph all over again. It's inconvenient. So we'll triple check to make sure that we're actually at the point 5, negative 2. And only after we're certain we're in the right place should we click on this point. And once that point is set, the line is drawn, and we can submit our answer.